Hi, I'm Nancy, Pampered with Diamonds. Hi, today I have got an unboxing for you. I wasn't going to buy any more paintings, but I saw this one. Joanne had a sale. I had a coupon for total purchase. You get an extra percentage off or whatever. So I, I did it. I bought another one. I did. I was on a live and this is for Diamonds by Tita. If you don't know who she is, go check her out. That's the name of her channel. She does unboxing. She does how-tos. She's just a little of everything. She did her first live, and it was awesome. It was a lot of fun. So go check her out. All right. Here we go. Vanity Owl. I have plans for this one, but I'll get into that once I get it open. This one's an older kit, I guess. I don't know. It was in Joanne's, so we get the sticker. The old style tool kit. With the pen, the baggies, the squishy, a clear tray. So that's the tool kit. And because I bought it in Joann's, I get one of these. I scan that code. Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. I scan that code and... This brings me to Diamond Art Club, and it activates my warranty. I still get the warranty when I buy from Joann's, as long as I do this within 30 days of purchase, and you do need your receipt. So make sure you do that. I haven't done it yet. I will do it when I put it away. Okay. This one is a 13 by 13 or 32.8 centimeters by 32.8 centimeters, a.k.a. a square. But are the diamonds a square? Nope, they're round. So here is our sticker sheet. 56 colors, which include one two ABs and two unique colors from Diamond Art Club and two fairy dust. Okay, this is your instructions, your thank you 10 for your next purchase and your VIP, all that stuff. Okay. This is what we all want to see, is this canvas. Okay, I'm rolling her backwards. There it is. Let me try shutting this light out. Maybe, yeah, there we go. I've got plans for this one. I have a person in mind that I want to give it to. What I'm thinking of doing is doing the whole owl and just a little, kind of a little around the edge, framing it out, cutting it, or maybe I'll mat it. I don't know, but I just want the image. I don't really want the background. I want to put this image on a black piece of construction paper or cardstock. I think it'll make it pop. 
So I want to highlight the owl. I don't really care for the white background. So I'm going to do the owl, kind of trim around and put it on, on black cardstock. Or should I take black uh, molding and put it around the side the way I want? What do you think I should do? Let me know in the comments. So here are the drills. Let's do this. Okay. You can't really see them that way. So let's do this. Only 56 of them. So when I come across, okay, this one is one of our fairy dust. Wow, this is all the white, 52. Let me do it. figure out without looking at the numbers. Here is a, this is a AB. Can you see that? AB in here, guys. When you see it, shout it out. There she is. 128. Pretty. Okay, there should have been two fairy dust, but I'm not sure where that is at the moment. Okay, looking for a four digit number for fairy dust. I showed you one. Where's the other one? There's the one, there's all the white. Oh, there's the other one, right there. And this pink is number 6010, 6010, and that's the one of the Diamond Art Club unique colors. And where's the other one? Now that I'm... Here it is. It's like a lavender. Pretty. All right. And our ABs are going to go... Let's see. In the frame... There's some twos and ones. They're going to go in here. And the fairy dust, they will be going around the edge also. Here and here in these rows down here, along here. Oh, cool. Around the frame, which is what I'm planning on keeping. 
I want to highlight and it's in his face and right in here. Oh, his face is going to be all blinged up. So this is going to be nice. Like I said, I'm kind of want to cover all this white in black. Maybe I'll just, everyone knows I don't really like 310, but maybe I'll make that 310. I don't know. All right. So that is my Vanity Owl from Diamond Art Club that I purchased at Joann's. And go get you one. It's beautiful. All right. That's all I've got. Have a great day.